Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to another video. Today we are going to STK Steakhouse at Disney Springs. So let's check it out. Here's the actual STK Steakhouse on the outside. We ate outdoors. This is the alcohol beverage I got. Wasn't very good. Uh, here's some bread. It wasn't that bad. Uh, that green sauce that came with it tasted like grass. I did not really care for it. I wasn't really impressed. The mac and cheese was pretty good. Uh, I did like that. The mashed potatoes were pretty good. I don't like asparagus. My wife, she got the asparagus. She liked it. That was good. Uh, then that little piece of steak right there, that was actually the American Wagyu. And then that right there is the ribeye. Uh, and then we went back the next day and got the Wagyu burger as well. And that was STK Steak uh, Steakhouse in Orlando, Florida. Uh, I it felt kind of overrated uh, the steak that we had. Uh, I was I was actually I was really disappointed. It was spendy. It was a really nice area. It had the ambiance, but the food just wasn't on par with. The entire setting uh, as you saw the ribeye uh, it looks nice but that was actually the second one I got I ordered a medium they sent me one that was just well done I sent it back they sent a new one and then they just sent it rare and I was like you know what guys thanks for trying but I will just pass I uh, we got two ribeyes and then we got the Wagyu the American Wagyu uh, they do have actual Wagyu. Uh, I decided not to get it. Probably should have. So I can't really speak on that. The American American Wagyu was good. It wasn't bad. It came with like a, a sweet like barbecue type sauce, and it was it wasn't bad. I I prefer ribeye. I think over that Wagyu that I had. Uh, granted, that was American Wagyu. It wasn't Japanese Wagyu. So there is a difference. Uh, the next day, we went back and we had the Wagyu Burger, which is also American Wagyu, but it's got uh, some of the fat trimmings from the Japanese Wagyu, like mixed and blended in with the Wagyu, uh, with the American Wagyu. And that was good, but also... I was a little bit disappointed. Uh, it wasn't as good as I expected uh, for being in, like, they say they're not a high-class restaurant or they don't advertise themselves as a high-class restaurant, but the area, the setting, the ambiance says different, and I felt like I was in a high-class restaurant. Uh, it just it didn't taste like it. It didn't meet my expectations. It wasn't a bad burger, and the price for the burger itself was awesome. It was only like 10 bucks. So given that, I mean, that you can't really argue with that. Uh, but for the ribeye, the previous night, that was up there in price, and I, mean, I wasn't going to spend 100 bucks on a steak that just wasn't cooked right. I was like, nope, mm, sorry. So... I guess I can't really speak too much on that. Uh, they maybe they brought me the wrong order, and then they rushed to bring the next steak out. Maybe it was an off night, uh, but I did not have a good experience uh, at dinner, at least. Uh, lunch was a lot better. The server was great. Food was for ten bucks. It was great. Uh, 
I actually, this is going to sound weird, but I've had the Wagyu from Arby's and I know, I know you guys are going to say, oh, that wasn't real Wagyu. Probably wasn't, but neither was the Wagyu at STK. It was American Wagyu. And I actually preferred the Arby's Wagyu. It was only like a limited time offer that they had out, but it's like, Arby's? Really? Arby's? Uh, they had really good water. I mean, if you're in Orlando or just Florida in general, you, you might have drank tap water before and uh, it's horrible. Uh, the water there was good. The, the alcohol drink that I had, I don't know if maybe the server just kind of misinterpreted a vibe that I was putting off or something, but I was telling them I just wanted, I was only going to have one drink. I'm not going to drink too much. Uh, I just, I didn't even want an alcohol drink and the, the, the beverage that he brought me would have been awesome if I really wanted to drink and just get drunk. But it was just like, it was like a cup of freaking vodka with like a little bit of flavoring. So if you want to get really drunk, they'll probably hook you up. Uh, but that's not what I was looking for. So I was kind of disappointed on that too. Uh, the side dishes, those were excellent. Uh, everything was a la carte, so those were all separate. Uh, you will end up spending a bunch. I think I spent almost three hundred dollars, and I wasn't—I was not impressed. I've had hundred-dollar meals that were way better. So that's STK uh, Disney Springs. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.